Ile, thanks for joining us here on Cherry the Geek TV. Thanks for uh, having you, me. sir. You, sir, are having quite the year. Not only is your show Rami uh, entering its third season on Hulu, all 10 episodes dropping September 30th, uh, but you also start earlier this year in Ms. Marvel. Uh, you're part, officially part of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Uh, both shows, Rami and Ms. Marvel, uh, are very notable for their positive portrayal of Muslim families. Uh, and you are starring in both of them. What's that like having a year where you get to be part of two big series uh, with a uh, positive representation of Muslims and Muslim families? Wow. Well, it wasn't, it was never part of my plan, but it, you know, I'm very glad it happened. No, it's, it's fantastic because, you know, there was a point like about five years ago when I said, okay, I'm only going to do anything that's positive, anything that's good. And I don't care what the characters are. I don't care if it's, you know, if it might seem bad, not because like Rami to some people say, oh, this is not positive representation, but I don't care about that. But it's just positive and real portrayal of real people, real stories and three dimensional. And and uh, and that's what I'm interested in. And, and positive meaning like three dimensional and clear and um, not traditional, stereotypical, what people expect. And and I feel that I was able to do that with uh, the imam um and, and miss marvel because he was just like the non not the traditional imam that people see because people you know all you know uh, religious figures are like you know feared and they're strict and they're you know stern and this guy's really cool he's funny and he's uh you know the kind of guy you want to go to the mosque to hear him speak so that's why i love doing that and then i mean what can i say about uncle nasim he's just like the most fun to play ever <laughs> So you've been in this business a while. Do, do you get a sense as an actor uh, from the time that you started in the business to the time when Rami premiered with season one? I mean, like you said before, there's in the past uh, Arab Americans, Muslims have had a uh, negative, uh, generally yeah. speaking, a very negative portrayal in, in media, uh, playing the, usually villains or or small roles like taxi drivers or. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But but now since Rami premiered, to now the, those that two to three year period as a as an actor have you sensed that there's that that it's moving quicker than it did from the time you started to the time rami premiered it, it is i feel like we my generation of actors there's a few of us like we kind of paved the way for this younger generation this younger generation now of like arab american actors or you know uh, actors in general like have uh, an easier path you know more choices than we ever did. I mean, I'll, I'll give you a, a funny example. My first, I got out of school 2003 and my first role was, a, I had two episodes of a popular uh, show called Third Watch. Uh, I don't know if you remember it, but, and I had one line. I was in I was in it a lot, but I had one line and we had a party. There were like 50 people watching it and we celebrated it. And my line, I played a terrorist and my line was Allahu Akbar and I scream it. That was my line. And, and, uh, you know, I did it. I didn't think about anything because I wanted to get into, into the union. I wanted to make money. I wanted to build credits. But it, it did hurt, but I had to do it. And then when you when we, when we when Miss Marvel came out, the first time you hear my voice, you hear it at the mosque, and you hear it in a, in a voice, in a voiceover. You don't see my face. You just hear me saying the prayer. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allah. It's so peaceful. The real meaning of the word. Allah Akbar, you know, and it's so funny to see where I started and where, you know, how far I've come with that alone. So, well, all 10 episodes of season three, Rami dropping September 30th on Hulu. What can you tease about uh, what we can expect from season three of Rami and 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 particularly with uh, the character of Uncle Nassim? I say a lot of lot of laughs and possibly some tears. <laughs> and, and maybe a trip to Israel. Maybe, maybe, maybe. We get to not, see right? Uncle Nassim visit <laughs> Israel. I'm sure there's uh, some comedy to be mined there. And uh, some, yeah, some things might happen. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> well, you can, uh, people can catch that uh, season three of Rami, September 30th on Hulu. Thank you so much for chatting Thank with you us. Thank you so today. much for having me. I appreciate you. Thank you. Pleasure talking to you. Pleasure is mine. Thank you. This is Rami. In Arabic, he's what is called Duniawi, lost in this world. Rami has been searching for something, trying to find the meaning of life. He is in debt, 
You owe Zayn one hundred thousand dollars. It's not just about the money. He's in spiritual debt. You're in spiritual debt. You're a you're asking for money. Like if it's spiritual, then well, can we just not charge so much? I know I feel, I feel, I feel. He's not sure what he believes. Do you believe in God? He's having a crisis of faith. I'm just trying to do something to help my family. His family searching too, trying to find their place in a world changing around them. Caught between who they want to be and who they really are. Maybe you would come to therapy. Therapy. Te magnuna wala e. Rami Yusuf as Rami. You have a line for people with American passports? I'm Ruekid as Farouk. That's business! He and Abbas as Mesa. I am the real housewife of New Jersey. May Qalamawi as Dina. I don't do Muslim dating apps. Laith Al Nakli as Uncle Nazim. Are you not a Democrat? Oh, I'm not a Democrat. You kids, you can be six different genders, but you have to fit into the Democrat. I'm politically fluid. Shady Alphonse, Julian Sergi, Mohammed Aymer, Dave Merhej, Mamiya Bouafo, Steve Way, Mika, and Bella Hadid. This fall, see the Hassan family like you've never seen them before. Will they finally realize that only God can save them? Inshallah. So, uh, how'd you guys meet again? Muslim match. You don't have to be Muslim? No, nah, there wasn't anybody on. Anybody? Rami, new season September 30th, only on Hulu.